Hi guys, CCTV Vlogger here. In today's video, I'm going to be talking about this. This is my big massive housing, what Alex the Geeker has sent me for free because I swapped some cameras from his. So if you want to go check his channel out, it'll be under below. So yeah, here we go. This is the housing. It's our Den Denard housing and um, I've resprayed it. All this had no paint on. I sanded it back and yeah, sanded it back and painted it. So, undoing the two screws out of the bottom, the top bit will come off. Set that side. This is the camera inside. It's a Vista uh, a monochrome camera and it's got a 3.5 to 8mm f1.4 lens on it. The lens is a Vista lens as well. It's wide angle and zoom in. So yeah. Uh, it's got the heat in element which runs off 12 or 24 volts. Uh, if you run the camera with the same power supply 12 volt and wire it into the heater it doesn't work. It powers the heater but doesn't power the fan. I mean the camera. So you have to run a separate 12 volt power supply for that to work or use a 24 volt power supply and hopefully that should split the power between the camera and the heater. So yeah, on the back we have this little thing which is a fuse. So just in case something does go wrong with the heater that'll pop and you'll have to replace that. So that just pushes back in there and you wire your 12 volt to there and that's how I've got my camera wired up I've just cut a normal BNC cable and just wired it back to the terminal blocks and this is the wire coming out of the back it's got two glands and that goes straight into the bracket it can come out of here or it can come out of there which I have got oh shit so yeah uh, it's got a mic this camera uh, it's got audio out, so you can, if you've got a audio liner well, you can attach that, so it's very versatile. And it's got a mounting plate which can slide in and out. Uh, yeah. Um, and that's pretty much it, it's got earthing terminals, and that's pretty much it. The housing just go, goes back on. My wires blocking it. Push that back in. And there you go. You just tighten them two screws up at the bottom. And yeah, you just mount it to your wall, adjust the camera, and that's your camera up. So yeah, thank you for watching this video, guys. Hope you like it. And please subscribe to the channel, it does really help me. And give me a like rating as well. And tomorrow's video will probably be the update, I've done some updates on my system with the wiring, I've uh, put a new wiring hole in my wall and that'll be in tomorrow's video so watch out for that, bye.